What's up everyone, I'm Stonewall and today we're going to be looking at the Nut Store Mini Modular from Laws Bricks. If you're unfamiliar with the Laws Bricks, they are pretty much like Lego, just 75% of the size. This is set number 1641 and has 485 pieces. But before I talk anymore, let's go ahead and build up the Nut Store. All right, so pretty good build. I always like building these mini modulars from Laws. Uh, I didn't expect a specialized nut store. Uh, I just assume most people get their nuts from the grocery store, but if you want those high quality nuts, you need to come to the nut store. I think this is a good set. I like the tree and leaf elements. I love the little squirrel and giant nut on the top. Taking a closer look at the nut store, we see there is a lot going on. Um, it's definitely tree and nut inspired, which a specialty nut shop should be. We Out front we see a big acorn sign pointing the way to the store, as well as a little sandwich street board sign advertising what they have inside. The facade of the first floor is really cool. I like the brown arch with the leaves on top. Looks like a couple trees out front of those two doors. Second floor of the front has some nice detail work that um, awning kind of reminds me of a cuckoo clock for some reason and then up top we got a couple really good looking builds we have a squirrel with a giant nut <laughs> the squirrel looks very animated cute little cartoon guy and then that giant nut obviously advertising what the store sells and a lot of gold trim pieces on the roof so it's going around the side, this one has um, these awning doors. Open those up so we can see inside a little bit better. They'll either need to be all the way open or all the way closed when you put them against the other modulars. Open those. Oh, I also like these, all these little cherry pieces. Fruit hanging off of the tree, those are in gold. On the back, first thing I want to point out is the little nuts sign. That is the brick heads of Dale on the Chip and Dale series. So if you saw my video on that, that's just the picture from him. So I thought that was kind of cool they included that. On the first floor, we have a big sign that says 
hot sale and has some prices for some different nuts. A little sign down there showing a looks like peanut butter and a little cash register back there. Some product in the middle there and then on the left side there is a little seating area. A couple chairs and I guess a, that's a nut in the middle that a couple people are going to share. Uh, second floor you can't really see in. There's a window there. You can see there's a big display nut inside and then on this side you can kind of see in. I don't want to take the roof off. Those guys are kind of finicky um, but if you look at this picture here during the build you can see that there is another table up there with a couple chairs, some sticker on the back showing some product and then up front we got some more products as well. Different nuts and nut butters I guess, peanut butter and that kind of thing. And then that giant nut over there on the right that I mentioned. One thing a li little weird about the set is these awning pieces don't actually connect. They're kind of just hovering above these flowers. They're just connected to the roof here. Um, it would have been a little better if they were connected on the bottom as well. A little more substantial so they don't fall off accidentally. Um, you can see some more stickers here for the tree theme as well as these giant leaf pieces up top which is nice. In addition to this we got a micro figure as normal and this is one of the new girl micro figures. She has some blonde hair which I really like having all these new micro figures instead of just more and more of that yellow one over and over again. So that's a nice addition. I did mention that these squirrel was kind of finicky. Um, he's probably not too bad if you build them how you do in the instructions, but since I was building from bottom up for the time lapse, man, those th this guy and this guy kept falling off and it was kind of a pain, but now he's on there. He's pretty stable, so happy with that. So yeah, all in all, a great set. Let me get the other three sets that came in this wave of the mini modular so you can see them all together. So this wave came with the nut store, the arcade, toy store, and candy store. If you haven't seen those videos yet, go ahead and look at them on my channel. They should be there. I really like this whole wave. I like all these sets. They all have different aspects to them. Let me know which one you like the best. Otherwise, just subscribe to my channel so you can catch the next video.